In this tutorial, we will teach you how to make a shield in Adobe Illustrator. To start off, draw an ellipse and from the Convert Anchor Point tool, make it a pointed edge and elongate it with the help of the Direct Selection tool. With the same tool selected, delete the top anchor point. Use the Pen tool to create a top portion for the shield. Place it on the top and adjust the anchor points accordingly. Combine all by right-clicking and pressing the Join option. Remove its stroke and add a gradient to it of six color stops alternating between white and dark gray to give a metal effect while keeping its angle at 90 degrees. Offset it by negative 10 point by going to Object, Path, Offset Path. Select the inner portion and change its gradient angle to negative 90. Further offset the inner portion by negative 4 point Fill it with a white to blue radial gradient and adjust its slider. To make the bolts, draw a small ellipse and fill it with a white to gray linear gradient. Adjust its size and place on the outer portion of the shield. Copy the bolts by pressing Ctrl C and press Ctrl V to paste them. Place the copies on the shield accordingly. Select the inner portion of the shield. Copy and paste it in front by pressing Ctrl F. Go to Effect, Stylize, Drop Shadow, and from the menu that appears, enter the values as shown. Copy and paste once again. Remove the Drop Shadow effect from it and add another one by going to Effect, Stylize, Inner Glow. Enter the values as shown. Group all of this and hide it by going to Object, Hide, Selection. Go to the Outline mode from the View menu. Draw a straight line and go to Object, Transform, Rotate. Rotate a copy by negative 5 and join these two lines by means of the Line tool. Copy it over with the Pen tool. Delete the original and keep rotating a copy of this by negative 10 point until you reach the shape as shown. Add a white fill to it and reduce its opacity to 30% while putting the blending mode to overlay. Make a circle originating from its center, smaller than the previous shape. Go to the preview mode and add a white to black radial gradient to it. From the drop-down arrow on the transparency panel, make these two shapes into an opacity mask. Create the background by drawing a rectangle the size of the canvas, adding a black fill to it. Right-click on it, drop down to Arrange, and select the Send to Back option to complete the illustration. Go to Object, Show All, and the shield appears. Adjust the size of the opacity mask and the shield as per your requirement, and your illustration is ready to use.